Welcome to the veterinary channel. This video presentation is about the most important bacterial disease in poultry, called as colibacillosis. Colibacillosis refers to any localized or systemic infection caused by entirely or partly avian pathogenic Escherichia coli. It manifests in diverse ways, such as fetal septicemia, subacute pericarditis, and cellulitis. Etiology Colibacillosis is caused by avian pathogenic E. coli, which is gram-negative, non-spore-forming bacillus, serotypes with somatic antigen 1, 2, 35, and 78 are frequently associated with disease in poultry. Most of the strains are motile. Epidemiology Colibacillosis has a worldwide presence, mostly in developing countries, that is, African countries and third world countries where proper care of poultry is not taken. It affects all types of poultry, wild birds and mammals. Clinical findings and colibacillosis. It is usually signaled by the appearance of diarrhea. Signs vary and can include acute fetal septicemia, ursicolitis, pericarditis, perihepatitis, and lymphatic depletion of bursa and thymus. Treatment of colibacillosis Antibiotics such as tetracyclines, sulfas, ampicillin, and streptomycin have been successfully used to control E. coli. Early treatment is advised with follow-up considering antibiotic sensitivity testing using the specific isolate. Thus, chronic stage of infection have a lower chance of being successfully treated. Control of colibacillosis Strengthening measures to clean and disinfect fertile eggs from the breeder flocks. Avoid incubating flour eggs. Increase sanitation in the hatchery. Reduce the risk of primary pathogen using bad security and vaccination in poultry flocks. Reducing ammonia and dust level in the barn may help reduce the environmental E. coli.